okay and this addition is basically most basic arithmetic operations okay this addition is basically most basic arithmetic operations this addition can be performed by a circuit which is known as adder okay adder is a combinational logic circuit which performs addition adder is a combinational logic circuit which perform binary additions we have a two types of adder that is half adder and full adder what is half adder so this half adder is basically adder which performs addition of two bits okay which performs addition of two bits using uh, this half adder we can perform addition of Two bits. Here, uh, in this half adder, we have a uh, two inputs and two outputs. These are uh, numbers or uh, organ and added bits are basically known as our input variable, and it produced sum and carry. Okay, so we have a uh, two inputs and two outputs. Here, we can make a table for half adder. So here, we have a uh, two input A and B and two output. Sum and carry, okay. Sum and carry. So here we have a for the two input variable, we have a total four possible combinations. So we can write a table like this: zero zero. So zero one one zero one one. So zero plus zero, sum zero, carry zero. Zero plus one, sum one, carry zero. One plus zero, sum one, carry zero. And one plus one. Sum zero carry one. Okay, so this is how we can make a table for half adder. So using this uh, truth table, we can identify or we can calculate equation for sum and carry. Then we can design half adder. Okay, so here this sum is uh, having a equation that is. A dash B plus A B dash. So basically, this is XORing operation. So we can write like this: A X or B. And for sum and for carry, we have a equation A dot B. Okay. So for carry, we have a equation A B. So we can implement this half adder with this logical function. So here we have a logical diagram of half adder A B XORing. So we have a sum and A into B and operation. So we have our carry. So this is half adder. Now what is full adder? So full adder basically a uh, adder which perform addition of a three bits. Okay, this full adder is basically adder which perform addition of a three bit. Out of which two bits are basically our uh, numbers, and this third bit is basically a previous carry. Okay, third bit. Is basically previous carry. So if we have a A and B uh, two numbers, okay, one bit numbers, and here we have a C in that is our previous carry. So here we have a two output sum and output carry. Okay, so here we have a table. For this uh, full adder, we have here three input conditions. So for three input conditions, we have a total eight possible combinations. So here we have a A, B, C in, and we have output that is sum and k. So we can add these values like zero plus zero plus zero. So we have a sum zero carry one, then zero plus zero plus one. So we have a sum one carry zero and so on. Okay, so we can mark all the entries like this. Okay, and then we can uh, identify or we can calculate equation for sum and carry. So here we calculate equation for sum. We write the values of sum or equations in which uh, there is a one. Okay, so we have equations for sum like this. We have here. 
दिस ए डैश बी डैश सी इन प्लस ए डैश बी सी डैश इन प्लस ए बी डैश सी डैश इन प्लस ए बी सी इन ओके सो इफ वी सिंप्लीफाई दिस इक्वेशन सो हेयर वी हैव दिस काइंड ऑफ कंडीशन विच इज ए एक्स और बी एक्स और सी ओके सो हेयर वी हैव अ कंडीशन फॉर सम दैट इज ए एक्स और बी एक्स और सी इन एंड वी कैन ऑल्सो आइडेंटिफाई द इक्वेशन फॉर कैरी सो हेयर वी हैव अ इक्वेशन फॉर कैरी ओके वी कैन राइट अ इक्वेशन फॉर सी इन लाइक दिस एंड दिस कैन बी सिंप्लीफाइड लाइक दिस सो ए इन टू बी प्लस ए एक्स और इन बी इन टू सी इन ओके सो दिस इज अवर कैरी इक्वेशन एंड सम इक्वेशन सो बाई कंसिडरिंग दिस इक्वेशन we can design full adder circuit so here we have a full adder circuit we can design full adder with two half adder and one or gate okay we can design full adder by designing this uh, two half adder plus one or gate okay so here a uh, first uh, half adder so here we have a this uh, a b xoring and a into b okay and uh, this uh, xor output is given to next xor so here we have a a xor b xor c okay so here this produced sum and uh, if we consider this a xor b and if we apply our a and b into output okay so here we have a carry uh, and then we or this okay so here we have a ab plus a xor b into c in okay so this is our full adder by means of two half adder and one or gate so this is full adder now let's discuss about subtractor subtractor subtraction is another most basic arithmetic operations okay subtraction is again most basic arithmetic operations this subtractor is a combinational logic circuit which performs subtractions okay this subtractor is a combinational logic circuit which performs subtractions of binary digits again we have a two types of subtractor that is half a subtractor and full subtractor so let's discuss first half subtractor half subtractor is basically a subtractor which performs subtraction of two bits okay subtractions of two bits so here we have a two numbers okay that is a and b and here we have a two output that is difference and borrow okay in a subtractor we have a two output that is difference and borrows so here we have a table for half subtractor two input a and b for two input conditions we have a four possible combinations and here we have a a uh, difference bit and borrow bit okay so for uh, this uh, subtractor 0 minus 0 difference 0 borrow 0 0 minus 1 difference 1 borrow 1 1 minus 0 difference 1 borrow 0 1 minus 1 difference 0 borrow 1 okay so this is how we can make a table okay now write the equations for this uh, difference and borrow so here we have a equations for difference and borrow for difference again we have a a dash b plus ab dash that is a x or in b and for borrow here we have equation a dash b okay a dash b so we can say that by inverting second uh, condition second inputs we can convert the uh, subtraction into addition okay because in addition we have a carry in which we have a equation c is equals to ab here we have a borrow that is a dash b okay so here uh, by complementing uh, this uh, next bit we can convert a uh, uh, adder into subtractor okay so here we have a logical diagram of half subtractor a x or b and we invert a here so here we have a not gate a dash and b so this is our borrow so difference and borrow this is our half subtractor now next we have a full subtractor full subtractor that means subtractor which performs subtraction of 3 bits okay which performs subtraction of 3 bits this two bits are our number and the third bit or says third number is basically previous borrow okay third bit is basically previous borrow and again here we have a three inputs that is a b and uh, previous borrow which is b i and we have a two output that is difference and borrow so here we make a table for this full subtractor we have a three bits a b and b in that is our previous borrow and we have a two output difference and borrow okay so here for a three in 
input conditions we have a total eight possible combinations so we mark all the combinations and then write the values of difference and borrow like zero minus zero minus zero we have a this uh, difference zero borrow zero then zero minus zero minus one so zero minus zero 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 minus one difference one borrow zero and so on okay so this is how we can calculate all the values over here and then we write logical expressions for this difference and borrow so here we have a logical expressions for difference and borrow okay so we can write our difference equations like this and then we can simplify this so we have a term that is a x or b x or b in okay so this is our difference equation and next here we have our borrow equation so if we write our borrow equations like this so we can simplify this so this uh, basically a b plus a x or b dash into b in okay so this is our difference and borrow equations by considering these equations we can design a logical diagram of full subtractor so here we have a logical diagram of full subtractor here we have a a x or b first uh, x or and then we use next x or so here we have a a x or b x or b in and here if we uh, multiply this uh, a dash b okay so here we have a this term a dash b and if we here again use not gate so here we have a uh, a x or b dash and then we or this so here we have a equation of borrow that is a dash b plus a x or b of dash into b in so this is our full subtractor circuit thank you